I ended up filming each of these separately. And this is from a Hazel. And I think I do say her name wrong. Hazel Anaka design, maybe. I actually um, know a couple girls with the name, they say it, Annika. So, um, but I, I think maybe I'm not saying it right. So I'll have to find out. And, she, and Hazel is also one of the collaborators in the Happy Mail movement. And look, I don't know, these, uh, Hazel and Christy probably didn't get together, but these colors feel like they all go to, I just love this. Ooh, these are like washi, washi stickers on here. Okay, Canada. I don't know what I was reading this to be, so this must be Alberta, maybe? I don't know. I have on I have a the list of it, so I'll so I will I will know. I will look at that. Oh, so cute. So this must be a um a magazine page. Or it could be a book page, but I can't tell. So must be a book page. A book page. Oh, I just love these colors. I love everything. Okay, so let's just set this right here. A D. Ah, oh, cute coat room. I, this must be like a real coat room check, which I've actually never seen one of these. I mean, I know they're a thing, but I've just never seen one. Yeah, very cool, very cool. Plus, how do you get one still intact? You know, normally don't they, they put one on the hanger with your coat and one they give to you? Oh, that's adorable. That's adorable. Nine of diamonds, so cute. I So I always keep an eye out at the thrift stores and the um, antique shops that I, you know, for cute little um, playing cards because I've actually never done an altered playing card and I thought I'd like to, but I've never actually found these are so cute. Flip flop, yes, I am ready for summer. I live in flip flops. <gasps> Another playing card. Oh, that's adorable. That's adorable. Postcard. Okay, I love this. So, in addition to being a filmmaker, I'm a local journalist, and so I spend a lot of time at our history. History Center and Museum, especially we um, we just celebrate our 150th anniversary as a community, and this looks like something I would have I would have found there. I just love that. Ooh, more wallpaper. Yes, this is for sure wallpaper. Yes, it must that other piece. They feel the same, so I don't think I was wrong about that. That is so pretty. I don't know is the camera catching. This is kind of a um a sheen. It's got like a real pretty kind of shimmer on that. Oh, that's beautiful. And oh, these little owls, so cute. So cute. So this is um, a ribbon that would make a great tag topper. Or I mean, you could maybe, might be, depending on the size of the book, you know, a smaller book, it could be a, um, a closure for it. Oh, so cute. And cute stickers. Right, these are stickers. It could be tattoos, I suppose, but I think they're stickers. Look at that, so cute. Oh, some fun pages. So these are very tiny little dictionary pages and some pages from a book. And I don't know the handwriting or the type of language this is, but I'm going to say, since these are characters of some kind, I don't know, that might be Chinese. I don't, I don't know, but I do love them. Oh, that's so fun. I've actually never seen besides what you get from Amazon, you know, directions in other languages. So sweet. Oh, that's beautiful. Oh, there's more. Can you see that? It's like a little, um, maybe a die cut thing, but you know what? That would be so good for doing um, texture uh, uh, stenciling. 
Oh, I love it. That's fun. Fun, fun. And then fun, like picture frames, maybe. Kind of like, um, it could be like a cabinet card. You know, you could put a, a picture of someone there with their name. So cute. Oh, I love it. Oh, thank you, Hazel. These are so sweet. And they're going to be so much fun to play with. And uh, I've got a couple different ideas here. 